Hi, this is Daniel Teti, CEO of Bitime Professionals and Embarcadero MVP. Now that Delphi can compile for Linux, I want to show you how to use Delphi Redis client on Linux. Redis is a very powerful key value store server used by the biggest companies in the world. While it is very common, it's very it's popular in web application, also traditional desktop applications can benefit by Redis. If you need to speed up your application, or if you want to optimize your data access layer, I strongly suggest you to participate to one of our Redis training. Today we will use a sample project included with a Delphi Redis client to show how it is possible to use Redis to integrate Delphi Windows application and Delphi Linux servers. So, uh, here we have our virtual machine. It is a new Ubuntu uh, 16 LTS. And here we have uh, our Delphi Tokyo 10.2. Let's start opening the sample project from the Redis client samples called Job Queue. This is the project group. Now, this uh, application is composed by two parts. This is the application itself, the, which will run on Windows, and this is the worker, which is a console application, which gets some job to do from the Redis queue, do the actual job, and then replies to the Windows application. Okay, let's start the Windows application. Okay, now uh, the application asks a username because we have to identify the um, the user which uh, asked for the job to do, for synchronous job. And then here we have um, we have uh, our PA server already running. Back to Delphi here, and then we can start uh, the worker on the Linux machine. Let's start the worker on the Linux machine. And now, as soon as started, here it is. This is the worker which is waiting, which is waiting for uh, jobs on the queue. This is a sample project which uses the live binding engine to evaluate an arithmetic expression. Here I have the Linux server waiting for the job to do, and here I have the Windows application which sends the job to do in a synchronous way. Get result. The Linux server gets the the job, actually calculate the result, and then responds to the Windows application. That's it. The Redis server is installed on Linux. And this is a plain Windows application, VCL application. Obviously, you can also use the same mechanism to uh, implement really a synchronous mechanism. For example, if I say that this application is uh, uh, the user is Daniele one, okay. Now I can start this request and just close the application. The Linux server is calculating the result and then respond to the specific queue. Then I can restart the application and authenticate with the same the same username and then I simply get the result in a very asynchronous way. I can use this mechanism also to prepare, uh, to generate reports, to execute very long queries, and so on. The good thing is that uh, now our worker and or our workers, because this worker can be duplicated on multiple machine or, or also multiple instances on the same machine, can run on on uh, also on Linux, and this is a very good, very good thing. Okay, bye bye.